Chinese startup DeepSeek's launch of its latest AI models, which it says are on a par or better than industry-leading models in the United States at a fraction of the cost, is threatening to upset the technology world order. Today and over the last couple of days, I've been reading about uh, China and some of the companies in China, one in particular, coming up with a faster method of AI and much less expensive method. And that's good because you don't have to spend this much money. I view that as a positive, as an asset. So uh, I really think if it's, if it's fact and if it's true, and nobody really knows if it is, but I view that as a positive because you'll be doing that too. So you won't be spending as much and you'll get the same result, hopefully. The release of DeepSeek AI from a Chinese company should be a wake-up call for our industries that we need to be laser-focused on competing to win because we have the greatest scientists in the world. The growing popularity of the Chinese artificial startup has caused the global tech stocks to fall shaking up the AI sector worldwide. DeepSeek's AI assistant, powered by DeepSeek V3, has overtaken rival ChatGPT to become the top-rated free application available on Apple's App Store in the United States raising doubts about the reasoning behind some U.S. tech companies' decision to pledge billions of dollars in AI investment and shares of several big tech players, including NVIDIA, have been hit. The company has attracted attention in global AI circles after writing in a paper last month that the training of DeepSeek V3 required less than $6 million worth of computing power from NVIDIA H800 chips. The quality and cost efficiency of DeepSeek's models have flipped this narrative on its head. The two models that have been showered with praise by Silicon Valley executives and US tech company engineers alike, DeepSeek V3 and DeepSeek R1 are on par with OpenAI and Meta's most advanced models, the Chinese startup has said. They are also cheaper to use. The DeepSeek R1, released last week, is 20 to 50 times cheaper to use than the OpenAI O1 model, depending on the task, according to a post on DeepSeek's official WeChat account. However, some have publicly expressed skepticism about DeepSeek's success story. DeepSeek is a Hangzhou-based startup whose controlling shareholder is Liang Wenfeng, co-founder of quantitative hedge fund Highflyer, based on Chinese corporate records. Liang's fund announced in March 2023 on its official WeChat account that it was starting again, going beyond trading to concentrate resources on creating a new and independent research group to explore the essence of artificial general intelligence. DeepSeek was created later that year. It is unclear how much Highflyer has invested in DeepSeek. Highflyer has an office located in the same building as DeepSeek, and it also owns patents related to chip clusters used to train AI models, according to Chinese corporate records. Notably, ChatGPT makers OpenAI define artificial general intelligence as autonomous systems that surpass humans in most economically valuable tasks. DeepSeek's success has already been noticed in China's top political circles. On January 20th, the day DeepSeek R1 was released to the public, founder Liang attended a closed-door symposium for businessmen and experts hosted by Chinese Premier Li Chong, according to state news agency Xinhua. Liang's presence at the gathering is potentially a sign that DeepSeek's success could be important to Beijing's policy goal of overcoming Washington's export controls and achieving self-sufficiency in strategic industries like AI, 